Hello, welcome back to episode 10 of March to October, the Detroit Tigers. It's been a trying time, given that we're 27 and 34. But I will say, I will find a little silver lining in that. To be only seven games under after, what, a 13-game losing streak, I believe it was, at its peak, is actually not terrible. I don't think I'm stretching too much to say that. We're 14 and 14 in the division. Uh, we're 15 and 18 at home. We definitely got to flip that at the very least. 11 and 20 at night. I don't know if these guys have early bedtimes, if they're afraid of the dark. I don't know what the heck's going on with that. But we're only six and a half back in the wild card. Although, as I mentioned last episode, the real challenge there is that there's six teams between us. Uh, and technically seven because we would have to thwart the angels and that's the bigger issue at this point than the actual games uh, because then you need those other teams to either you know be even enough to to leapfrog them or worse and so that's the big challenge but it's still relatively early in the season quick scan through the standings if you want to take a look and if you didn't finish all the way through episode nine then you might not have seen that we added another piece to the bullpen in the form of zach Britton. Now, he's having a terrible season thus far statistically, but hopefully we can control him better than the computer has been. 650 ERA, 206 whip, that's brutal, but we needed somebody. Gregory Soto was the only lefty, and he hasn't been very good himself. So my, my hopes are that I can do well with him when I utilize him, and then the computer sims, uh, you know, come back down closer to where his levels are. You know, he's 75 right now. He shouldn't be this bad. You know, the 24 hits, I got to imagine. I don't think they count. Are they track Babip here but they've got to be awful he's got a 450 fit that's fielding independent pitching that's an idea of, of what his ERA would be if you just kind of looked at his core skills so he's been unlucky so I think we can get get him better and now with the with the addition of Stripling and Britain we've added two big pieces to the bullpen and we've got a little something going here with these three at the back end let's take a quick look at the trade window before we get into today's game we also made a quick ad had to do it had to do it my boy, the Franimal, he was MVP in my in my Oakland March to October on stream. And I understand that he may not emulate that and we want to find and discover new players. But when somebody's that good and I enjoyed using him that much, I had to put him on our board here. Especially as the fact is um, that we've now added two relief pitchers. We don't need to have any on the, uh, on, on the trade board here as targets. We could still use more relief, don't get me wrong. But we're going to start looking in different avenues with an ace, uh, premium center fielder, strong utility guy, who I would put at third, by the way. Or, uh, no, I'd put him at third. Maybe left field, because Chris, Kristen Stewart's been brutal. Or Fran Mil Reyes, who would go into left field himself. So we could definitely use any of that for sure. And hopefully we get some more trade offers coming up in the very near future. But in the meantime, I have to show you a little something. Because she might not make her, her normal appearance on the episode on her own so i have to show you this little rito over here i obviously put the blanket on her she doesn't get the blanket on herself like this but come on come on look at this little rito she's just a little burrito and i can't i can't help but love every bit of it so anyway we just got back from my sisters they have two dogs uh one old and 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 kind of grinding through life uh Stay, stay, stay strong, Frankie. The other, Chauncey, very vibrant, and uh, she loves to play with him. So every time we get back home from my sisters, she is out. If you're going to watch me stream today, which I'll be starting right after this video goes up, or as this video's up, actually, uh, if you're watching it on March 27th, uh, she'll be conked out pretty much the entire stream. She'll wake up to EAT and, and use, the, use the bathroom outside once, and that's about it. But anyway, let's get into this. We got a, speaking of Oakland, I got to pull a two to one uh, victory here. I got to pull a comeback victory in top nine to really get us on a roll. This could be huge. This could absolutely be huge. We've got Cameron Mabin against Yusmero Petit. Yusmero Petit comes in with a lot of slow stuff. Sit back, wait. Don't get out front too much, Paul. Pep talk for myself. We can do this. We can do this, but it's it's crucial. Obviously, we don't have much time. We've got three outs here to get this back. All set to start the ninth in this one. Here's Cameron Maben now. He could really use a knock here. We're going to take, take off rip. So far. Let's get a look at a pitch here, see what's what. From the stretch. Good pitch. 
And that's about as hard as he throws. The 92 miles an hour is as hard as he throws. Hey, we're gonna we're gonna act as though we are gonna make this comeback here. We're gonna have to pitch the bot nine. At the very least, I hope to get a bot nine into a top ten by getting the one run, if not getting two, and then hoping for a save here with Stripling. All right, one one. Now we're dialed in. Getting a video gamer stance over here. Get pushed forward. See what we can do. Come on. Come on, Mabes. Two one. Here we go. Now, in real life, Petit is not afraid of a same handed changeup. So I want to look fastball, but man, I think that changeup might come. The pitch. And it was the curveball, and it was two, such two, a hittable two, one. If I'd have stayed in the changeup look, I might have been ready for that. Now I'm thinking. Heat to wipe me out. Lifted Didn't quite get it. Early, slightly rolled. That's the 88 fast right fastball. It away, Dang no it. Problem for the first down. All right, Miguelito. Miguel You're one of the only good players on this team. I fixed the lineups up a bit. I had mentioned in episode 9 that uh, via my experience with the Oakland A's MTO, they can get changed a lot. That's kind of one of the bugs that they do need to fix is that sometimes they just change them. And obviously you don't want that. Uh, first offering on its way. He's trying to jump a first pitch heater. And, he's well and I was too late. Hey, either this hitter wow. needs a cup of coffee or he was sitting off speed. Now, um, a a strike to when Cabrera. you change them, hey, they the moment that's the already set up, so like that that's already like loaded. So no matter how much you change your lineups, it like won't be in the very it. next moment you play. Early, I told you, he throws stuff so slow that I knew I knew this was going to be the challenge. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Sit back, come on. Maybe I should actually sit back. Three balls and two strikes to the Take a base runner, man. We'll take a base runner. Come Every on. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So you can't afford to be giving out free passes. Here we go. Going to have to pinch run Miggy. Let's go. They'll probably suggest it. I know one thing. He earned that free Three for three. Scope is three for three. Triple shy of the cycle. What we got for pinch running? Jack shit. Dwell Lugo, still better than a zero, believe it or not. Crazy, I know. Right there, he was tempted with some right, really go. good pitches, but he stayed disciplined and threw the walk. Now running at third for the Tigers. Here's the first pitch to him. Ground ball, foul down the left side. It's so hard to stay back. These pitches are so slow. And double play ball game. Oh, it's on the ground a second. Did he get his double play? I'm the worst. There's one. Back to first, a double I'm the worst. Play. And with that, the More ice pellets. Game is over. This is so hard. This is so hard to come back with these with this team and play well. We gotta get on a run, man. I gotta have a string of moments where I achieve the goal. I gotta hit like a three, four moment streak. If we're gonna have any chance of doing something here. <laughs> And getting into the playoffs. I'll take a wild card, man. Awesome. Win. Okay, okay. Uh, give me a win. Give me a win. Oh, jeez. Ooh, call up opportunity. Daz Cameron. Daz Cameron's hitting well. And we're not going to get. Okay. So I'm a little reluctant to put, down, put Christian Stewart down, despite the fact that he's been brutal. Because he's a lefty, and I know that's not a great reason, but we have so few lefties. Jordy Mercer is actually playing really well. Ivan Nova. You can probably go. Or one of the clowns in our bullpen, let's be honest. Oh, they won't let me send down one of the clowns. They're like, no, you gotta keep those idiots. Um Yeah, then it's gotta be Nova. We, we got to keep the the hitters. We got to do it. Got to do it. Let's do it. 
And then do we get a Daz Cameron debut? Do we get a Daz D-butt? Cool way to say debut. Don't sound stupid at all. Okay. Play well for a season boost. Let's go. Let's go. Do something with your life, Paul. God. Yes, put him in left. I, oh, Kristen Stewart finally on a on a hot streak and gets gets his job taken away. Sorry about it. Should have hit a hot streak sooner. Yeah, you know? Yeah, Daz is in at left all over the joint. I'm here for it. I am here for it. How's the pitching looking now? So we lost our long reliever, but you know, Garcia can be that. And I'll leave him here though. I don't mind not having somebody exactly in the uh, the LRP slot. I don't think that's necessary in any capacity, is it? How's Garcia been doing? He's been terrible. Actually, maybe I'll pitch less if he's there. So maybe I will do that. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get a Daz debut here. And uh, use that as uh, part two here of episode 10. He's going to face Mike Fires. Okay. Another guy who's going to throw everything super slow. So be ready. Sit back. Don't get out front. Don't roll over everything. Do something with your life message to myself and to you guys why not well hope everyone's Dance staying Cameron safe out there i know this has been the show and finds himself a trying time today. and uh guys, we're grinding through it once this season and now they've done it again hopefully you to think they're hoping he can inject uh, some energy into the offense they're oh from double a big year and they must Hopefully MLB is a nice uh, so reprieve that for us. Always intense so Matt Chapman oh God, don't fail. Well so far Matt, in this I'm series, scared. he's three for nine. He's so always always intense, man. Oh God, and I'm always catching this. There is this ball is belted high in the Boom. air out to left. Stud has to retreat to the track, but he has it to retire the side. A's are gone in order. It's the A's nothing. Tigers come. Not even hard, dude. Oh boy. At the plate, Matty o. Matt Olson, a real Coming threat oppo. with the bat, of Scared. course. He currently leads the American the League in home Scared. runs. Nah. This guy's right in the A on homers. career right now. The power bat speaks for itself. One of the more dangerous Easy. hitters in the game Easy. of baseball. Cameron, a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first. All right. Two catches so before his first at bat. Cameron. He's in. He takes his first dad played. This man, he looks a lot like his dad. My goodness. Here we go. First pitch jumping if it's in the right zone. Right here. This is the zone. From the belt. Kicks and nope. deals. Not where I wanted it. And Dan Dero, these A's as they begin. Oh, my first play for Houston? Afternoon. I didn't even they know. Come off another loss last time out, and in fact they've dropped three of their last four. Yeah, Maddie, dropping their last game. Now they Hopefully everyone's hiding their children with Mike Fires on the right bump now. here in Detroit. They gotta find a way to get on a hot streak. You cannot continue to go peaks and valleys throughout the course of this season and ride that 500 line all year at some point you're going to have to take 7 out of 10, 8 out of 10 yep. to get this going in the right direction agreed, agreed, we need a big hot streak set to deliver on nothing in two here it's it the comes. only way we have a chance here I got I got a string 3, 4, 5 moments of hitting exactly what they want me to do didn't work but now we'll see if that sets up some different options wouldn't be surprised to see a good slider down and away right here. shot baby let's go driving that's a base hit and Yo, a if we can field. give daz a three pellet make him you know uh aid him into becoming and one of the key no pieces of our person in the ballpark of our daz entire Cameron lineup has just collected his first hit in the big leagues the and as is customary the there's the ball being sent into Thanks. the dugout the pretend he throws it in the stands away for him to put in his trophy case yeah good for him and congratulations Rip. listen he's worked his entire life perfect for this perfect moment. baby he's obviously trying to play cool get off right me. now but you can bet inside his head he's on top of the world up again let's go oh that's Mabes. Mabin. i'm on base that's right check out his righty lefty splits no surprise that he hits better against southpaws than he does against right handers weekly hit to third Chapman's got okay. it. And Nothing we can do there. Will not come to pass as the inning is over. What's the score? I'd also like to win. One up, up one oh. We can help this. Striding in. Daz can make this better. On a single in his yeah. first try. I mean, that's the wrong part of the park to go to. 
but we put a good swing on it. I mean, I I don't feel bad about that. It's just it's so hard to go yak in center field at this park. So one gone for the A's in there. Nobody on, two out. Don't mess up, Paul. Ramon Laureano. Oh God. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Where is it? Left fielder is oh God. Move. They didn't let me move. They're making me move all casual. That's horrible. He's on his way to third. And he will make Y'all. I'm the worst. Yeah, I acknowledge the that. Extent. But they were making me move all weird flat footed. Like no doubt the hell. It's two to one now. We gave up the lead because of that. Now in the box. Watch out for this one. Del can slur. Two trips to the plate yeah. thus far. First pitch of the at bat. Nah, Chappie ain't messing with that. Chapman brings it in. Shoot. Rwanda Olson will take care of him at first, and that ends the inning. I'm mad now. And that'll bring in Ramon Laureano. Now batter, number 22. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Cameron is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat right. back to first. Man, I am really mad about that. I, I listen. I do play defense terribly. I'm an idiot. Own that. I was trying to go back, and it was doing this like casual back foot trash. Oh, Petit again. Oh boy. Oh, are you serious? That was weak. That was weak. One pellet, maybe. Oh, we got two. Okay. We'll take two, but we didn't get the win. I gotta be honest, I would have taken one pellet for a, in exchange for a win. <sighs> Man. Another non win. Let's see if they uh let's see if we can get a fire pellet off of that. Or at least get rid of that. No, they gave us Wait, why'd we get ice on just getting two greens? What? Loss. Loss. Win. Win. Loss. Oh, trade time! All right, let's see. Okay. Oh, we just got Daz, man. I'm not. I'm not sending Daz. I'm not sending Daz out on a deal, even though Eaton's probably the best, and he's a left-hander. I've got enough inept fielders, and that's a big price. I think Yanni is gonna be the, the scoop here. Isaac Paredes. Not sure that uh, he's coming out. Whoa, is this a new? Oh, it is new content. Ty Cobb out. Nice. Yeah, I think we need another arm. I think this this would work. And we put uh, we're gonna put him in Zimmerman's spot. Yeah. Oh yeah. God yes. I mean, we could put him in anybody's spot, but we're hoping that top four get better. How's he been pitching? Not bad. He's a superstar on this team. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Paredes is a little bit of a high. Well, not really. Not really. We weren't going to use him this year. Okay, we're doing that. We're doing that. Please give me more trades too, man. I'll take every trade I can get. I think they're going to give me a debut for Chirinos after this. All right, perfect. This is where we're going to cap it, though. We're going to have Yanni Chirinos coming out for episode 11. Uh, we'll start with his debut. And this has to be the spurring, okay? We're at game 72. We're almost at the halfway point. We're at 31 and 41. We've lost three games now. We're projected for a very nice amount of wins. I will say that. Won't get us to the playoffs, but it is very nice. Check the wild card standings. We're eight and a half. Still with the seven teams that we would have to thwart. That's a lot. At least we didn't lose standing there. Um, we did fall further back. We've got Chirinos now. We've got uh, Daz Cameron up. You know, we're starting to get some things cooking. It's high time that I get my act together. Okay, so we're gonna have to do that. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Hit that like and subscribe. Back with episode 11 very soon, over the weekend for sure. Probably Saturday, but I can't fully commit to that. So I just wanna say weekend right now. Thanks for watching.